Hi guys, it's Miss G. Happy Wednesday. Today is Volcano Day. I thought that I would make my own volcano because I know my kids at home will love it. And then that way you guys can see different ways to make volcanoes at home with parent supervision. All that you're going to need is, for my volcano, is some baking soda, some vinegar, a funnel, food coloring, and some sand. And a bottle for it all to go in. We're going to make ours like prehistoric dinosaurs are going to be on it. You're going to have a, a volcano mountain. And then you're going to get to see it erupt. My volcano, you're going to need some dry sand. You're going to need some water. And then you're going to mix it together till it kind of looks like beach sand where it can make a sand castle. So that's the texture that we want so it will form around our bottle. Okay, you're going to just take the sand and you're going to just mold it around your bottle to try to form your volcano. All right guys, after you have it decorated and looking like your volcano, you're gonna take your funnel, you're gonna stick your funnel inside. I have a dinosaur here, so I'm gonna have to use both hands. But you're gonna stick your funnel inside and you're gonna pour your baking soda down inside. You can use as much as as little as you want. The more you use, the more vinegar you need to use to make it more of an eruption to your vinegar you can make it with as many drops as you want the more the drops you do the darker that it will be and then you stir it up to the color that you want and i think that our color is red right. and then you're gonna take your vinegar and red dye and you're gonna pour it in you're gonna see what happens Ooh. And we have a volcano eruption. <laughs> and it's knocking down the dinosaurs. I don't know if we have enough. Uh, oh. Yeah. Alright guys, I hope that you enjoyed the volcano. And maybe you can make your own at home with your family. 